So today I will teach you One UI 7, 10 different tricks on your Samsung Galaxy S25 Ultra or other phone as well too. Please subscribe my channel and share this video. So let's get started. What are the 10 features on the One UI 7 on your Samsung Galaxy phone? So let's go. Well, we are going to set up wallpaper. Really cool way of making wallpapers. So let's just say I'm going to make some wallpaper. Okay, I'm going to go to the image. And then I'm going to see there's a lot of different wallpaper. I'm going to say wallpaper, okay? This, you can do it on your Google whatsoever. So let's just say this is the wallpaper I like to do, okay? So now on the side here, there's a, this thing called AI Select. Press this and then wait for this. And now you see it already highlighted. At the bottom here, you want to press three dots and select as wallpaper. And then they will ask you, which one do you want? You want lock screen or you want just a home screen or both? I will just say home screen. Press next. And this will be my wallpaper. And then press done. And the cool thing is right now on the One UI 7, they will ask you, do you want to match with the color at the background too? So you can see right now, it's actually matching with the color at the background. And then just select whatever I want and then press apply. And now, even my menu, my calling, my texting, everything will be mixed with this color, okay? So this is a very, very cool way of making a wallpaper with your color palette. So the second features on the camera itself, you can see the menu is actually right there now, okay? So now let's just say if you actually press record, and now you can actually zoom in and out very smoothly. You can see that. On the One UI 6.1.1, if you want to zoom in, you have to use both hands. Now, there's a, this bar here. You can just go drag here and there, whatever you want. Just say right now, you scroll from the top down. You can see this panel completely change. Right here, this is your manual right here. Usually, you turn on your Wi-Fi whatsoever, right? Now, you see the Wi-Fi and the Bluetooth has separated. Did you know that you can actually press the setting button? You can drag this back to the top, so closer to here. And in addition, you can actually press edit and then you can edit whatever you want from here and then you can put it back up as well too. So this is a very, very cool way of doing things. Okay, you can just put it back up and then now when you're done, you just press done and then that's it. So you can change whatever you want and then that's it. Pretty cool way of making a different notification bar at the top now. So let's just say you go on good luck right now and then when you go to good luck, you want to, and then now you want to go to the home up. When you go to home up, you want to go to right here, only one UI 7, okay? You want to go to home screen. When you go to home screen, make sure you turn this on. DIY, DIY home screen, make sure you turn this on. Once you turn this on, you go back to your home screen and then you just hold. At the top there, you can see DIY home. Now you can customize the size. You can customize anything you want, okay? So let's just say you want it smaller, you want to you know, make it like straight. Whatever you want, you can do anything, okay? You can see that. So say like right here, I just tap, and then just like resize this, and then that's it, okay? And this is how you do your customizations. Pretty cool, huh? And then when you press done, you just press done, and then that's it. This is DIY, spend more time, customize your home screen, it will be much nicer. So right here, you can see this, okay? When you call someone, there is like this button right there. When you press this button right there, did you know that they can actually, just, you can start recording your conversation on the phone? So you can, you can see it start recording, and then basically it will start recording on your device to keep it a record. When you hand up, they should have a session for you to look at, hey, you want to look at your history, record calls, and then record calls, and then you can see it shows you what did you talk within the conversation. So on the last screen, you can see right now, the clock is actually bigger because on the One UI 7, you can actually do that. So all you have to do is, is just hold it, and then you unlock it. And now you can see there is actually a different way of 
customize your lock screen. You can actually customize the style. So usually I tell people to select your style first before you go back font and color. Because sometimes, let's just say I select this font, okay, this style, you cannot change the font anymore because they already preset for you already. The only thing you can do is you can change the color whatever you want. So you can customize these, okay? Now when you're done, you can add widget, whatever the widget you want, you can add it in. So let's just say whatever, right? I'm just gonna put battery, and now you see the battery is there as well too. So this is the best way to customize your lock screen with no issue, just like very, very fast, you can customize everything. So, so next feature is, it's actually the AI right there, and then the happy face right there. This is a Samsung keyboard. When you actually press this, there's actually a blue button right there. When you press a blue button, did you know that you can actually customize uh, stickers for you? So you can say tree, apple, let's no, just say whatever, right? And then 3D image, click there. And now they might gonna create a tree, apple tree for you with no issue. There you go. And then when you press done, and then when you press send, now you send an apple tree to your friend. In addition, on the AI right there, you can press the AI. You can actually check the spelling and grammar and you can check, you can do your writing and style as well too. So let's just say if you have something like this, like I'm writing something really, really interesting, press this, press paste, and now I want them to regenerate the style for me. So I just want to highlight everything and then writing style and then they will write everything for me. Professional, casual, social, polite, okay, so on and so on. And you can actually replace the whole passage with this new conversation. Now let's back to the side right there. On the top here, you can see there is this recent app. So the app that you just did, all up here at the bottom here you can see there is so many app on the side so usually it's located on the side right there you can see that how do i do this it's actually quite simple because it's already on the side so you don't have to turn on anything and now you press a pencil right there and then you basically put everything into here whatever you need to do and then on the top there you can see there's three dot you see there's an option you can actually touch and hold or tap to make a split screen. Or you can actually do the recent button, uh, leave the AI in there or stay there. But this one is actually pretty cool. So if you actually want to do a split screen, let's just say I want to take this out. Now I want to do a split screen, come up again, tap, you can see split screen right there. Super simple and easy. The final trick I would like to show you is, it's actually on the side there, it's called Join Assistance, it's right there. When you do the Join Assistance, you can create logos, you can ask them to create some type of join, and then you can copy and drag it out, and then you can do something else. So let's just say you can draw it out, you can use pictures, and you can use text. I can actually use text and say that Apple Tree tax maybe maybe it works it might not work and then i say 3d okay so i want a tax of apple tree can they generate so basically this one here it, they will generate anything you want so you can see the apple tree so now i'm going to use the ai select maybe i'm going to select this okay and select this and then did you know that when ui7 you can just hold this it will drag out the apple tree for you. And then now you can save it as in the sticker as well too. Pretty, pretty cool, okay? And then they'll ask you what type of sticker do you want, what color and things like that. You press done and then that's it. This is your apple tree right there. So you can use it anything you want on WhatsApp or whatsoever you want. These are the features, 10 features on the One UI 7. Doesn't matter which one you have, this one will work on any other phone. Please subscribe my channel and share this video and have a good day. Bye bye. Peace out.